Hi, I'm NASA Kennedy's Laura Aguiar, and I'm taking you inside KSC. Orion's Launch Abort System, or LAS, has rolled out of the Launch Abort System facility. It was a 10-hour trek to Space Launch Complex 46 at Cape Canaveral Air Force Station, made on Wednesday, May 22nd. The LAS is now one step closer to launch of Ascent Abort 2, which will test Orion's ability to abort during liftoff. The uncrewed launch is currently scheduled for July 2nd. This critical check will ensure the Orion spacecraft will be the safest ever to carry astronauts. It will ultimately pave the way for the agency's Artemis II, which will be the first flight of Orion and the new Space Launch System rocket with astronauts aboard. The same system that will be placing the first woman and the next man on the moon in 2024. Members of the media are getting ahead of this summer's biggest anniversary story, participating in the Apollo Then and Now Media Day at Kennedy on May 23rd. In preparation for the 50th anniversary of man's landing on the moon, the press talked to experts about the historical significance of different areas on center. They visited sites like the VAB and Launch Pad 39B and talked to leaders from NASA's past and present. The look back is also a look forward to the moon. We are going. And remember, Spaceport Magazine digs deeper inside KSC.